to my YouTube channel. Today we're gonna do another Halloween makeup. This time we're not going to do any gross type of makeup. We're not gonna use any fake blog and blog and nothing like that. But it's still going to be a really intense, tricky makeup. Um, what are we going to do is to do half our face is going to be a really like skull type of devil face, and the other half is going to be normal, a little bit. Mark on the um, dark circle I'm going to no use uh, molding wax to um, really intensify the bone structure in our face. But you can do it with um, shadows and light. So you don't need to use special effects to it. You can just use um, um, you can use just makeup. But um, let's start. Let's get into to it. The first thing I'm gonna do is cover one of the eyes, um, eyebrows, the eyebrow part of the, the eyebrow size or the part of the face that we're going to do this scroll. or artificial um, flesh on top just to create a completely smooth area because we don't want to look to see any hair at all now I'm gonna apply a little bit of concealer knowing that we're gonna apply foundation on top but just to blend a little bit in so now that we have it like that we're gonna start working in the school part this right here and we're gonna start using our um, molding wax or fake, fake flesh to um, give volume to the bone so I'm gonna do one right like here I got my picture here this way my drawing one right here I'm gonna create some intensity around the eye also and on the cheekbone so let's go step by step and to really stick into our face, we're going to use liquid latex to stick it in. with um, a foundation
wax is, is lifting out a little bit and just adding a little bit of liquid latex to um, make sure they won't move. Be careful around the eye, um, don't put liquid latex on because it will really kind of burn your eyes. While the liquid latex is getting dry, I'm going to do a little bit of this other size. I'm just going to um, re, um, intensify a little bit the eyebrow, intensify also the lash line and giving a touch of extra color into um, the dark circles. For that I'm going to use all the, all the tones from the Sleek Palette Matte, the dark ones. extra touch of the um, um, contouring. Good, now I'm gonna go over uh, the liquid latex and apply uh, more foundation. is to making this part right here a little more greeny so I'm gonna um, mix a little bit of the green um, uh, aqua tone from the Lancrum palette this one right here and with the foundation and give a small touches all over most in the, in the hollows area not on the bumps I'm doing is softly apply with one side of the sponge and blend it with the other. What is left in the sponge softly apply all over on the bumps. back to the halo area and we're gonna mix the green with the black to give um, more depth on the, around the area just to create the depth there now I'm gonna concentrate uh, around the, the bump black I'm gonna do the same with this small brush um, to create a little more intense depth of black all over the rest of the hollows. that I've been using for the more blending part and I'm gonna start like coming into the bump leaving the um, higher part of the bump more free of color and the rest it will be like start blending into the darker Just a 
rough touch of um, burp, um, sorry, of yellow in some areas. Just a small, smallest touch of the dark red and uh, just close to the eye. So now what I'm gonna do is to um, apply a little bit of mixture of the green and black and all that tones in half of my lips and the other half of the lips I'm gonna do a strong red lip. finished look it's a little bit like um maybe so much fun when I start feeling a little bit bad oh shit what's going on hope you liked it I hope you will try as always closer pictures and the full list of products that I used will be in my blog the description box um the link will be in the description box below here thanks so much for watching and see you next time and see you in the next Halloween tutorial thanks for spending some time with me bye Oh.